Uh, it's Kern at plus 650, Bayern at uh, minus 295, the draw is at plus 500. I expect Bayern to get the job done, but this may be a game where if you're live betting and Dortmund are winning, then I think that maybe Kern may may score. This might be one of those games where both teams to score and over. Uh, Alex, Bayern ver- away at Kern. This is going to be a tough little game because unless Bayern get their own way and get their noses in front early, the pressure is going to mount. Yeah, uh, and uh, I was when I was uh, making sure that uh, I have the best uh, value bet for this match. I was thinking ex- exactly like you. What will Dortmund do in the in the uh, in the other match, and how will Bayern react? This is why I think that Bayern will start uh, on a strong note. I think that they will try to solve uh, this match from half time. I think that they have the power, even though uh, FC, F- FC Köln um, are. Are playing good lately. I mean, uh, two two wins against Hertha, against Leverkusen. Of course, that uh, that win against Leverkusen. Uh, let's face it, uh, they were prioritizing uh, uh, the Europa League. Uh, Hertha is uh, bottom of the standings. So uh, I think that we shouldn't give them that much power only by checking the standings and the le- le- last results, because. We know that Bayern Munich uh, are just waiting for a bad step of Dortmund to win the title again. And I think that they will start strong. So personally, I'm going with halftime, full-time. And I found that at minus 120, I think this is the only way that you could go. I don't think that uh, we should give uh, Bayer, uh, uh, we should we should expect them to cover the spread, the minus 1.5. Uh, we've seen what uh, they did in the last matches. Uh, of course, that uh, you will say that okay, they won 6-0 against Schalke, but that's not the case. Um, so yeah, I think that this halftime, full time looks like the best value bet in my opinion. And what about the under four, by the way, at minus 135 for Kev? Do we not think that that could be a parlay piece with the uh, the under Dortmund team total of what was it Dortmund not to score four? Minus 155, minus 135, because if Dortmund are winning and Bayern are winning, there's nothing Bayern can do. Yeah, that's true. Uh, it's not for me. I, I, I just think if you're going to put, I always think if you're going to put someone in a parlay, you've got to be fairly confident with it. And I wouldn't be here. Because, uh, to be honest, I wouldn't go anywhere near this game personally, because I think there are too many different possibilities. Uh, and I think. Bayern priced like the Bayern of a few weeks ago or the Bayern of a few months ago, um, not the Bayern of now, which is a completely different animal. Uh, I don't think they've played well for a while. I think even if you look at some of the wins they've had over Hertha, over Werder, they didn't play particularly well. And Köln are dangerous in the sense that final home game of the season, Jonas Hector's being waved off, so that's a really big deal for them. Stefan Baumgart's just agreed a new contract. I think it will be a really buzzing atmosphere there. And they'll love to mess up Bayern if they possibly can. So for me, that minus 295 is not of interest at all for for Bayern to win the game. Uh, They could. Of course they could. And Alex might be absolutely right. And I'll cheer him on because I haven't got a view in this game. Um, But it's not one for me because I could see Kern being awkward here. And I actually think in the last few weeks, they've played really, really well. The draw at plus 500 is way overpriced, by the way, because Kern are difficult to break down, OK? Now, it might take them 20, 25 minutes because obviously you've got the last game of the season in a crowd and they're all buzzed up. And we talk about the home side here. Uh, and Bayern will have to take their time because for Bayern, it's all about just winning. Now, I just don't see that there's five, be- five goals because Bayern... Are not going to go press it forward. They don't need it for goal difference. It's all about them just winning the game. Um, at minus one thirty-five, it just seems to be that that is almost a guarantee because I, I just I just don't see Kern folding, and I don't see Bayern pushing forward because they've got to keep the back door closed. Uh, very very interesting game, but obviously this game takes on completely different meanings because of what's going to go on in Dortmund. So let's have a little look at the official pick. Myself and Ale- uh, myself and Kev both left it alone. But Bayern, half-time, full-time, minus 120. Bayern come out of the traps and it is job done. And it's, uh, yeah, if they go in front, 
then I fancy it is over minus 120 to be the leading at half time and still pick up the three points. Thank <laughs> you.